Now that's a snowy eagle. <laughs> and we got another uh, tree face. Mom likes putting faces on trees and statues of deers and ah, she's pretty cool. We had some deer out here this morning, but I woke up late. She fed them. That would have been cool. Oh well. And there's the cabin in, be in behind the uh, house. I've done a video here. Got chair all over, uh, snow all over my chair. And There's not much to chapter six, so I thought I'd blow it out real quick. There's only one drink in it. I didn't bring anything to drink, so I'll I'll have a drink at the beginning of chapter seven, which I'll probably attach to this. It's not too long, but a lot of drinks in chapter seven. So I'll do those tonight. Chapter six of Jacob. And now, behold, my brethren, as I said unto you, that I would prophesy that the things which this prophet Zenos spake concerning the house of Israel, in which he likened them unto a tame olive tree, must surely come to pass. And there it was. That's the one drink. I'll have that later. And the day that he shall set his hand again, the second time to recover his people, this uh, is the day, yea, even the last time that the servants of the Lord shall go forth in his power to nourish and prune his vineyard, and spread a lot of dung. <laughs> and after that, the end soon cometh. And how blessed are they who have labored diligently in his vineyard. And how cursed are they who shall be cast out into their own place. And the world shall be burned with fire, just like his orchard was going to get, vineyard was going to get burned. And how merciful is our God unto us, for he remembereth the house of Israel, both roots and branches, and trunk, and bark. And don't forget the sap. Don't forget the sap. <laughs> and he stretches forth his hands unto them all the day long. And they are a stiff-necked and a gainsaying people. But as many as will not hearken their hearts shall be, uh, shall sh harden, shall not harden their hearts. Uh, uh, bad lighting, sorry. Shall be saved in the kingdom of God. Wherefore, my beloved brethren, I beseech of you, in the words of soberness, something I'm not going to do, that ye would repent and come with full purpose of heart and cleave unto God as he cleaveth unto you. Does he really? That's nice to know. And while his arm of mercy is extended towards you, in the light of the day, in the light of day, harden not your hearts. Yea, today, if ye will harden, uh, hear his voice, harden not your hearts, for they, for why will ye die? I'm massacring this, sorry. I'm not doing it again either, it's a boring-ass book. <laughs> uh, 
For behold, after ye have been nourished by the good word of God all the day long, will ye bring forth evil fruit that ye must be hewn down and cast into the fire. Behold, we, uh, behold, will ye reject these words? Will ye reject the words of the prophets? And will ye reject the words which have been spoken concerning Christ? After so many have spoken concerning him. And deny the good word of Christ. He hasn't said anything yet. He ain't alive yet. And his parents haven't even been born yet, or his grandparents. You prophets. The power of God, the gift of the, 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 gift of the Holy Spirit, and the quench of the Holy Spirit, and make a mock of the great plan of redemption, which hath been laid before you? Know ye not that if ye will do these things, that the power of the redemption and the resurrection, which is in Christ, will bring you to stand with shame and awful guilt before the bar of God? Of God? And according to the power of justice, for justice cannot be denied, ye must go away into that lake of fire and brimstone, whose flames are unquenchable. Unquenchable. Hmm. I'm getting a little thirsty too. And whose smoke ascended up forever and ever. Bullshit. Maybe you're talking duration, not distance. But you did say up. <laughs> oh, then, my beloved brethren, repent ye, and enter in at the straight gate, and continue in the way which is narrow until ye shall obtain eternal life. You can just go on with your boring ass life forever. <laughs> oh, be wise. What can I say more? How about you're done? <laughs> Finally, I bid you farewell. Until I meet with meet you before the pleasing bar of God, which bar striketh the wicked and the awful, and with awful dread and fear. Amen. And that's all there was to six. Uh, and I kind of butchered it a bit. But fuck it. It's not worth reading again. I will uh, continue on with seven. I might post this one by itself, just just to put a short one up. Peace. The fuck out. Have a wonderful whatever the fuck it is. As long as there's no cars. That's yeah, all right. Okay. You're all right to take it moving? Yeah. All right. I'll go real slow. Yeah, just, um, it doesn't matter. I'm watching behind me. I might not even use this, but um, yeah. it's just like it's sometimes I tack something on at the mm -hmm. end of something, even only a part like of something. being on top of the world up here. Yeah. That's what it feels like sometimes, you know, from here, especially. Oh, what a feeling. Yeah, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh. Yeah, see how I <laughs> photograph of it now? I mean, I'm barely aiming it. Uh-huh. That's cool. Let's go on, it's right. right. Okay. Should have brought my, my window mount. A little suction cup, you stick it there and actually drive while you do a video. This is heartbreaking. This is where they clear cut here. Yeah. drive up around here. Well, a lot of people couldn't even get in and out without it. Now, with me, most of the time, I'd, I'd probably be okay if I didn't have it. There might be just a very few times in the year when it might be a problem. There are people that, most of the winter, they have problems. This is a real, pretty 
can't imagine being a foot out here, but some people are. Yeah. And they make it. They make it work. But there are times you can get down this road. See, they haven't lost their snow. And they still got a lot of snow in the trees. We're starting to lose ours because we're in the sun more. They're in the more in the shade. Tire down, sunk down deep. Wow, that's a problem. Well, there's some people up here without four wheel drive that try to drive this road, and yeah. this is not so bad now, but two days ago it was really bad. By the way, for the record, this is Forbes Town Road. Forbes Town Road. Yeah. Is this old Forbes Town Road no, or just no, regular? Just Forbes Town. Okay. There is an old Forbes Town. I thought there was, yeah. Yes. And a lower Forbes Town Road. These fires. They're, yeah, they go off of this one and back on. They're, they're loose. I want to go up that New York flat uh, road and look, and maybe yeah, in the okay. spring. We can do that. Oh, well, we got a car full of, we'll have a car full well, of water, but we can still do that. I was thinking maybe oh, not in that this time of year, okay. though. But All right. Yeah, one of these days, fine. I'm going to go up there and check it out. Sure. I was thinking in the springtime. Well, maybe if you can come back in the springtime, we can sure do it. We should, we should hit a few old things down here. Mm. Or small ones. <laughs> you know, that you can see through just barely. But if, if there's nobody coming, it looks like not much traffic. I should be able to get pretty well stop. Just a little bit from I'm not quite sure. Yeah. I'm not sure. But well, around one of these bends, I don't know how close we are. Okay. Don't worry about it. Try right here. This is where it is. So, here's this no, that's there. fine. Yeah. That's perfectly all right. Yeah, well, maybe on the way, but it will, that's the best way. Pure water is the best gifts that man can bring. Directed by Butte County Department of uh, looks like maybe agriculture. Yeah. And this is where we get our drinking water here, coming out of that pipe.
Wow, that's really a close-up. Do you see the same recording in the corner? Or did you turn it off? Yeah, it's moving. Okay. Okay, well, I'm overflowing this one. PvC pipe. That's pretty clever. <laughs> yep. It works. 